so uh, we're going to open the floor up now. Um, put that away. Mark, you're going to start it off this time. Yes, thank you. Finally, well, some recognition here. Um, this is for you. Yep. I don't know how you guys feel about this, but you know, often you come home, I don't know where you've been, but two, three o'clock in the morning, hear the door slam, you know, blah, laughing, laughing, chatting, drinking, good, good times. pumping sort of bloody your metal, heavy metal, and um, you and bloody that fat Tomo coming home so the early hours of the morning, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't often know. three or four times a week, I don't know, can we not, maybe just once a week or something? Uh, I don't like that fat Tomo guy, I think he's a bad influence. Well, I don't like fat Tomo. Yeah. I hate him. Yeah. I'm not a fan of him. Tomo's my friend, alright? He's going through a rough patch. He's homeless at the moment, so... It's not out. He's bloody got nowhere to sleep, mate! I'll tell you what. Sometimes he comes into my room and like, kicks me out of my bed. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. Not I'm a bit nice. sick of it, to be honest with you. Well, just, just, he's like that. Just I've say, been doing it for the last few weeks, just having to I leave. I found us. cigarette butts in my shoes, and none of us here smoke. Rebecca certainly doesn't. Maybe she should right. mask up that bloody smell. All right, anyway, it's about fat time, mate. Yeah, no, fair enough. Uh, but, you know, like, he has got nowhere, so, you know, I'm just trying to do, you know, what would Mother Teresa do? That's what I always like to think. She wouldn't smoke weed at 3 o'clock in the morning with fat time, mate. That's a good point. That is a pretty good point. I understand you've got to be there for your friends, especially if they're going through a tough time. Maybe just be a little bit more considerate with the people around you. Yes. Next. <laughs>